YouTubers out there, it's James Hobbs fan coming to you. Uh, today is, let me just check the calendar, August 27th, it is 2.11pm my time. Uh, this is my second attempt at doing this video because my mother just called on the phone. Anyways, uh, I'm going to be smoking some Maltese Falcon, you guys have already seen this before. Uh, in other videos, some GLPs, Maltese, Falcon. Uh, this is my second to last tin left. I'm about halfway through, or a bit more than halfway through this tin. The other tin is in my bug out bag. Uh, if you guys don't know what a bug out bag, it's basically an emergency preparedness bag that I keep by my front door just in case I have to bug out and uh, leave just in case of a natural disaster or something uh, happening. So, uh, as you can tell, my son is goofing off right behind me. So hi to everybody with YouTube. Hi everybody on YouTube. I hope you're going to start a great toy. Yeah, uh, anyways, go watch a movie. Okay, bye. Uh, I'm going to be smoking in a big corn cob. I've already added, packed the pipe. So, uh, let's see. Alright, Warden Masters. William, can you stop eating uh, that, please? My son's just chewing on the CD case of the uh, movie. And no, this is not a uh, Missouri Mirchum. Sorry, a Missouri uh, corn cob pipe. It's just a generic corn cob pipe that I found in downtown Montreal. Paid ten dollars for it because I thought it was kind of kind of big, kind of cool. But now I'm realizing that the bowl itself, the corn cob, is really cheap. So, compared to my uh, actual uh, Missouri corn cob, which is right here. I don't know if you guys can tell by the bottom of it. But uh, that's an actual Missouri corn cob pipe compared to this one, my bigger one, which is cheap. <laughs> but hey, it does the job. I'm actually getting kind of fed up of uh, smoking Maltese Falcon, so I'll be glad when this tin is actually open. Cause I don't like cracking open a new tin of tobacco until I'm actually uh, done with it. Because lately the heat over here the past couple of days has been really, really, really hot. And uh, it's taking a toll on my humidor, my cigar humidor, and my uh, pipe tobacco in general. So. I'm looking forward to trying my unopened tin of GLP's Westminster. I'll probably be cracking that open probably by the end of the week. My pipe club meeting has been moved from Tuesday, the uh, September 4th, to Wednesday, September 5th, all because we have Quebec elections going on over here. So, and there's going to be a couple of contests during my pipe club meeting, too, that's going to be going on. So, uh, yeah. There's a pipe maker in Italy that has donated about seven items, including a $250 pipe. I haven't seen it yet. My friend is the one actually taking care of that one. So what I might actually do is one of the pipes that Patrick, the pipe, has uh, sold to me. 
one of them that was originally supposed to be for a YouTube uh, contest will actually be for a pipe club contest to make it actually eight gifts. Because I, I always like to bring gift to my pipe club meeting and have that raffled off and uh, stuff like that. But at least it's going to get Patrick's name known uh, around the Montreal uh, area. So Patrick, if you're watching this, one of your pipes will actually go to a good home uh, around here. So this way you have uh, two Canadian Quebecers or whatever Montrealers that yeah, own your pipe. And uh, I want to thank, take a chance to thank all of you guys for joining my Boyo Dude Club on Facebook. Thank you. Uh, we're up to, I think we're about 15, maybe 16 members right now, which is really great. Uh, I just want to see, would like to see a bit more of your guys' pictures and your video of your Patrick the Pipes pipes, your PSP pipes. So that's related to that. And then I've also made uh, a Facebook gathering or event or whatever you, you want to call it too, in honor of uh, Patrick uh, for October. I think it's October 2nd I, uh, I have it. In honor of Patrick's first... YouTube video. So if you guys haven't seen it, the link is on the Boyo Dude Club on Facebook. And it's just a, a, a general event where all of us that own a PSP pipe will just log in to Facebook on that day, on October 2nd, and go to the Boyo Dude Club page and just chat about Patrick and his pipes and etc etc post videos post pictures stuff like that and it's a 24-hour day uh, event so once again that's to honor Patrick for all of his great work that he's done with uh, making pipes and uh, all of his videos that he's made for uh, all of us so that's just my way of giving back to the pipe community and giving back to uh, Patrick so I don't want to make this video too long because I'm Waiting like a like a pig right here. It's actually quite hot. My apartment reads 32 degrees Celsius, but I also got a couple of fans going and uh, stuff like that. So it's actually a bit harder than that. And no, I don't have an air conditioner. I'm in a four and a half uh, apartment. So, anyways, that has nothing to do with it. It's just I don't have an air conditioner. <laughs> so, anyway, this video is getting a bit long. I still have to upload it to YouTube. So I'm wishing you guys all well and uh, happiness and uh, hoping that you guys upcoming work week is going good so uh, take care thank you for subscribing to my channel and viewing all my videos and look up my fan page for Patrick uh, Patrick the Pipe for his PSP pipes once again it's called Boyo Dude Club and if you haven't bought one of his pipes or asked him about one of his pipes or whatever, please look him up. I know I've repeated this a couple of times, but uh, I feel that he's an underrated pipe maker. And he really does a great job. He really does. Uh, by the way, I still haven't smoked out of the pipes that he uh, sent me. I will be smoking that, like I told you in the other video, during my pipe club meeting, and I will be filming it. So September 5th, I'll be filming it and posting it probably the day, the night, uh, the day after. My son is distracting me here just by being a little boy. Right? Want to say anything to YouTube? Yep. Ha! Have a great day. Have a great day. And I, I got a nice medal. Oh yeah, yeah. My son got a medal for his soccer uh, yesterday. Yeah. So he enjoyed that. First year playing soccer and first year getting uh, an official medal. Yeah, but so. the next year I might play karate. Yeah, you might do karate next year. I might enroll him in karate. So anyways, have a great day. Thank you for watching this video. And, uh, yep, thank you all once again. All right, thank you. Have a great day. And James, have fun.